The 13th annual Red Lake Wellness Summit is taking a new approach in order to inspire attendees. Reporter Sherell Moore tells us why organizers have chosen to focus on recovery instead of addiction. This year, the organizers of the Red Lake Wellness Summit wanted to really speak to its attendees. That's why they put a focus on recovery and breaking the stigma. We usually do a, a summit of some sort, you know, around the, the addiction process and things like that, but this year we want to focus more on wellness, the, the recovery aspect of the addiction. You know, once you've been to treatment, not there's the recovery that goes with it. The Wellness Summit is spread throughout three days. Each day features a variety of speakers and workshops that are meant to promote wellness throughout the body, mind, and soul. All of the events also have a cultural aspect to them. A few of today's workshops included traditional teachings, recovering from grief, and powwow zumba. We had uh, some medicine plants and things like that. Uh, we have our, some of our programs, we're showcasing some of our new programs we got here in, in Red Lake. So there's a wide variety of different programs going on within this uh, conference or gathering. So This was the first time the Red Lake Wellness Summit was held here at the Red Lake Tribal College, and it turned out to be a huge success. Over 300 people attended throughout day one and day two. We have elders, we have infants here. Uh, it's just a time of celebrating recovery. You know, we're pushing that. We're celebrating. We're winning the, the, the war on, on health initiatives. We're winning the war on substance abuse. And, uh, you know, it's, it's good that, you know, we, that we, we can celebrate that together. We As the day goes on, attendees leave with a positive attitude. And that's exactly what organizers want to achieve. That's what we want to put out there. There are a lot of good things happening also, not just drug busts and overdoses. And not just in Indian country, all over the state. You know, we just got to learn to look for the good things in our communities. This is truly what it means when we say wellness gathering is Take what you have and go forward with it. So we're celebrating here. Reporting in Red Lake, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. And the Wellness Summit will continue tomorrow at 9 in the morning. Anyone is welcome to attend. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.